Now let's move to the activity that we have, which is called multiples of the multiplication chart in build activity. Here we are going to learn how to use the multiplication chart to determine the common denominator for fractions. We will solve together problem one, in which we are going to have two equivalent fractions. Let's write them together. The first fraction is one over four. And the second fraction is three over 12. Now, we want to find a common denominator for the what? For the two fractions using the multiplication chart. Now, the first step is to look at the multiples of the denominator of the two fractions, which are what? 4 and 12, and to determine the common multiples of these two numbers in the chart. So, if I look at 4 and 12, over here, 4 and 12, the first common multiple is going to be what? 12. What else will we find? We are going to find 24. And then what else do we find? 36 and so on. So what do we get? We can continue, we will also find 48 and so on. So these four numbers can be the denominator of the two fractions. However, we will notice that 12 is the denominator of the second fraction. So we can change the first fraction only, which is one over four, and we will have a second what the same denominator. So next to the fraction one over four, what are we going to do? We are going to write another fraction with the what? With the same denominator, which is 12. And because 12 is the third multiple of 4, then the numerator will be the third multiple of 1, which is what? 3. So the new fraction that we are going to write now, equivalent to this, is equal to 3 over 12. شوف الحلقة كاملة من خلال تطبيق مدرستنا بلس مدرستنا مستقبل يبدأ الآن